Welcome to the second edition of Ask an Aggie. My name is Nick Carroll, and today is Ash Wednesday, so we've hit campus to find out what people will be giving up for Lent. Ash Wednesday signifies the beginning of Lent, in the 40-day period prior to Easter Sunday, when Christians celebrate the resurrection of Christ. Repentance is commonly practiced during this time by placing a cross of palm ashes on the forehead through prayer and fasting or sacrificing of something of importance. And today's Ask an Aggie question is what are you giving up for Lent? I'm giving up sugar because I'm very fond of sweet stuff and even though I'm not Catholic as a Protestant, when I give up something I really enjoy, it helps me remember God and what he's done for us by dying on the cross. All right, I'm here with Jenny. Jenny, and uh, I'm asking today what people are giving up for Lent. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm still working on it. I'm going to be fasting for a few days and then kind of figuring it out. Not eating past, past nine. Just because like it's, because I cause usually eat at night and then like, you know, it's kind of like a struggle for me. It's now you pass nine, so that's what I'm doing. I'm here with? Alfredo Rodriguez. And today's question, I'm asking you uh, what you're giving up for Lent. Um, I wanted to say swearing, but that ended up pretty quick today, so. Probably going to get sweets. Go with sweets? Sweets. So you're the second person we've come up with sugar. Are you giving up all, all sugar or just sodas and cakes and cookies and other things like that? Uh, no, just cakes. And chocolates, anything like that. And are you going uh, all 40 days? I can go 40 days, yeah. And have you been to Mass yet today? At 7 o'clock in the morning. So I'm here with? Veronica Fernando. And Veronica, what do you plan on giving up for Lent? Um, I thought about it, and I thought I could do a practical thing, which was give up cursing for a while. Give up swearing and cursing? Yeah, but then I also thought about something like I can give up that's like physical. And I thought about just some food that I shouldn't be eating. Such as? Such as like chocolate, you know, every girl's favorite thing to eat. <laughs> so sweets and other things like that? Yeah, pretty much so. I'm giving up all my negative attitude because anything, every day is a gift from God and we have to take every day as a great blessing. So any kind of little negativity or irritation or annoyances, I'm giving all that up. Well, I'm here with? Molly Fluey. And Molly, what do you plan on giving up for Lent? I'm actually giving up an hour of sleep every morning to go work out instead of giving everything up. So it's not necessarily like a tangible thing, but it's a, it's a goal or something? It's a goal, and it's for health, and it's for you're giving at least an hour of sleep up. So. Will you be doing it for all 40 days? All 40 days. Maybe beyond, too? Hopefully, but we'll see. I'm looking to see if you've uh, decided what you're giving up for Lent. I actually haven't really decided yet, but I'm probably going to go with um, soda. Soda? Yeah. All sweets or just soda? Mm, that's a good idea, actually. Did you give anything up last year? Yeah. What was it last year? Um, I don't remember. And that's all for Asking Aggie this week. My name's Nick Carroll with AGTV.